to be naked today, so let's do this. I smoke to stay away from my shit work schedule. Yeah, really? it's a shit work schedule, yeah. So, um, I haven't smoked as much as I have since I started working here. Okay. Because it literally does help. Good. So what's this little market the beast system over here? What is this? Oh, okay. Yeah, Jing Yin for each one of All us. Right. Last thing is a hernia check like we did in sports. Well, what's a hernia test? Cough. Oh, the, okay, the balls. Okay, the balls. yeah, that's fine. That's cool. <laughs> Freeze. You're under arrest. Hey, we're good. Come on inside. Corner. And cough hard. <coughs> oh, it's fine. Okay. All right. Days on the grind, peeps. It's Friday. My herbal jar. <laughs> Awesome. Is that awesome? Yeah. Is that awesome? Mom got scared. Action. Hey, what's going on? This is Alex and I'm Johnny and we're fire hunters. We're looking for fire ass strings. So what we're gonna do is we spotted this crazy big freaking cloud. I'm gonna show you this fire, it's crazy. We're gonna try not to run these Walmart pedestrians over. Captain America. Oh, so I don't know how to do that. I can't be a. Oh my god. Let's, dude, where is that? Okay, so I was gonna do a borderline funny experiment, but not a lot of dudes walked into the courthouse today. Anyways, on the plus side is I fought the law and the John won $100,000, and that's how you roll. Mercedes Love, $25. That's all you get, officer. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just psyched that I'm done and I'm coming down. Oh, man, you can't go to court high, man. That's just so hard, dude. It's like, ah. Even talking to clerk, it's like, they know you're gonna throw your ass in jail. <sighs> so I'm here. This uh, episode is brought to you by your favorite, Bubble Up. Don't forget to drink it up in your stomach. Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> it doesn't taste pretty shitty. Myself, I pre-rolled two swerves, two Maui pineapples. So the difference between these two, uh, I love this one the best. It's my favorite wrap. This blunts that I rolled, these are of CBD herb, only CBD herb. It's weed that has no THC and you can roll it up and smoke it. And that's what I have in here. And the CBD is for my anxiety and I, I still like to smoke blunts. And it actually makes me feel good, not high. It doesn't make me feel like really good like it puts me in a good mood and gives me a little bit of an energy boost i love it honestly i love it around the end though like after like half hour 45 minutes i feel a little tired and that's just normal because the cbd's medicine is in effect even smoking it orally whatever i had to come to court today because i had a traffic violation and i had to show my proof of insurance i didn't have my proof of insurance card for the mercedes so like i didn't have anything to show the cop it, it was 2 a.m in the morning i was on my way to work i'm like dude what do you i didn't even oh life sucks because i'm going to work i get pulled over and he wants my insurance i'm like yo i don't have an insurance card i don't have an insurance card for this car but i do have insurance for my other cars and I didn't have any cards to show him. And I forgot I could have showed him on the phone from the Allstate app. But at 2 a.m. in the morning, that's what I'm saying, I forgot. As I forgot, he gave me a ticket for not having insurance. And then they send it to me in the mail. They send it to me a courtesy notice that I have to pay $900. And I'm just like, dude. What? I was baked at the time. I was in the coming down a little bit from being baked, really baked. And... I saw that courtesy notice and I just, I read the total bail amount and I just freaked out. I got so paranoid. I was like, oh my God, I hate the government. It sucks. Hey. All they want is our money. Just getting all crazy and I didn't read everything else on the thing. And it said, just come to court and show that you have proof of insurance from a previous car. As long as your insurance date shows that it's before you got the ticket. And I was just like, oh my God, I felt so stupid. This is so dumb. I am so dumb. 
scratching all that, I got my shit together, I got my paperwork together, I got Wednesday off from work, and I decided what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna smoke the CBD blunt, the one with CBD in it, I'm gonna smoke that one before I go to the courthouse. And I'm gonna be relaxed, I'm gonna be focused, and my mind will be all well put together. Well, I accidentally made a mistake, you see. The blunts that had dank in them instead of just the CBD without THC, smoked on without paying attention. So I ended up smoking a blunt, a solid doobie that's pretty dank, and I'm accidentally smoking it relaxed, smoking the whole thing to my dome. And then, uh, and then, boom, it hits me, dude. I'm just like, oh. Shit. I am so not supposed to be baked because I got to go to the courthouse and bro Governments buildings and government officials and anything government when you're high and you have to be around those things It is sucky bro. It is the like the TSA style checkpoint at the judge's place courthouse <laughs> and you're like oh my god they're gonna see inside of the x-ray machine cavity check put their gloves on and put their finger in my oh my god up your butt oh easy so yeah when you pre-roll blunts and you put them back in their original cases always write on the blunts on the wraps this is THC and this is non THC if you're like me um, but you're probably not gonna ever encounter this situation or scenario. I am weird and different. But if there's other people out there like me, then hey, this video is for you, okay? And uh, yeah, all right, yeah, have a good one. <laughs>